Assalamualaikum and good afternoon. So we are on the final uh, part of our uh, search uh, chapter. So today we will look at the uh, Minimax. So Minimax is a game playing algorithm where uh, you and your opponent would take turns. So the player and the opponent will take turns. So the opponent will usually uh, represent a human or another computer playing our algorithm or our computer so it is mostly used in turn turn based game playing where we have an opponent try to thwart your every move so you can see minimax algorithm are in play uh, with turn based games such as uh, tic tac toe uh, the most convenient example and then chess and checkers and uh, many more uh, games so we look at the minimax uh, question so uh, in minimax question usually um the question will begin with a seat number okay seat number so this is the seat number so uh, usually is set by random randomly and then the question uh, would usually ask you whether you want to maximize or minimize the opponent movement so in this question we will maximize the opponent movement so let's see that uh, how uh, the maximize opponent movement uh, works. So when the question asks about maximize opponent movement, you start here by labeling the top level by max. And then next you label it uh, with min. And then next max. And if you have another level, you label it with another min. Okay. What happens is here it is thus. You select the highest number, 4 and negative 5. So, which one is the highest? So, in max, you select 4. Okay, because 4 is the highest. Okay, uh, don't be confused with the negative 5. Okay, some students would uh, confuse with the seemingly higher value of negative 5. But actually, negative 5 is lower than 4. So, 4 and negative 5, max, you get 4. Right, next, you have negative 5 and 1. So, which are the higher? Okay, max, 1. And then next, you have negative 7 and 2. Higher number would be 2. And then negative 3 and negative 8. So, higher number would be negative 3. Then uh, negative 8. It's not negative 8. Because negative 8 would have lower value. Okay, compared to negative 3. Negative 3 have a uh, higher value. Okay, next we look at the uh, next level, mean. So, 4 and 1. Mean means that the lowest value. 4 and 1, lower would be 1. 2 and negative 3, lower would be 3. So, between uh, these two, 1 and negative 3, what will be at the top? So, because the top is max, yang mana satu value yang akan naik ke atas? Which one? That would be considered as highest. So the final answer would be 1. Hmm. So 1 uh, is the final answer. So we look at the slide. So 1 is the final answer. Alright. We look uh, more into other example. Okay. This is another example. Of a final examination question, perform minimax on the game tree, taking into consideration where we want to maximize A move. So when you want to maximize an A move, you have to start with max, okay, on the A. Next level, you put it min. Next level, max. Another level is min. Okay, because the next level is max over here, 1 and 3... You have to select the higher number. 1 and 3, we have 3. 2 and negative 1, we have 2 because 2 is higher. 4 and negative 2 is 4. 1 and negative 1 is 1. Max 
goes as the mean. 4, 1. A lower number is 1. 3, 2. Lower number is 2. 2 and 1. Higher number is 2. Right? Okay. The final answer would be 2. So, uh, let's look into another example. Same tree. But, we have to minimize the A move. Okay? Minimize the A move. Perform minimax on the game tree, taking into consideration where we want to minimize the A move. So, when we say that the keyword is minimize, we want to know about, uh, we want to ensure that the top level of the A node would be min. Second level will become max. Next will become min. Next will become max. So it will be alternatively. If we start with max, next level will become min. Then next will become max and next will become min. And when you start with min, next will become max, next will become min, next will become max. So 1 and 3 mean we have to select lower 1. 2 and negative 1, you have to select lower negative 1. 4 and negative 2, you have to select lower negative 2. 1 and negative 1, you have to select lower negative 1. And then for the max, 1 and negative 1, we select 1. Negative 1 and negative, uh, negative 2 and negative 1 higher would be negative 1. Okay. And then, which is the lowest between 1 and negative 1? So, it will become negative 1. Okay, negative 1 lebih rendah daripada 1. Okay, negative 1 is lower than 1. Okay, that's why it, uh, we have a mean over here. So, the final answer at the top would be negative 1. Okay, uh, I think that's all for our uh, lecture. So, we look into the practice make perfect part. So, in our classroom, uh, we have practice make perfect. Uh, so, we try to do our own uh, exercise. Okay, uh, let's look at this question. Apply minimax on a game tree in which the tree would lead to win for maximum. So, to do this uh, for basic uh, minimax, uh, you have to determine whether it will lead to a win for maximum or minimum. So, because it is a maximum, so we have to write here max first. Okay, max will start uh, at the top. And then, uh, the next will become min. So, the lower uh, doesn't matter. Because we already have uh, the number over here. It is already preceded. So, we have to determine which of the number that would be uh, entered to the top. So, between 3, 8 and uh, three, eight and 12, which of the number would be the lowest? The lowest would, of course, be 3. So, kita akan dapat 3. So, we become 3. So, the value would be 3 over here. Okay, here. 2, 4 and 6. So, which are, are of the lowest? Of course, it will be 2. And then here, 14, 5 and 2. Which of it would be the lowest? Okay, and then it would be also 2. Okay, for the next level, we have max. So, max means we have to select the higher number. The so higher number between 3, 2 and 2. So, which uh, of these that are higher, highest? So, we have 3. So, put over here the number 3. So, this is the answer. Okay, the final answer. So, you select, uh, here is the lowest, okay, lowest, 3, 8, uh, 12, 3, 2, 4, 6, you select 2 because it is the lowest mean on the mean level. 14, 5 and 2, you select 2 because it is the lowest level. And then max, in the max, you have to select the higher, okay, the highest number, okay, 3. 
Okay, what happen if we are playing for the minimum? So when you are playing for the minimum, then you start out with the min, and then the next level will become max. So uh, when you are in the max, you have select the highest number. So highest number between three, twelve, and eight would be twelve. So the highest number between uh, two, four, and six would become six. And the higher number between 14, 5, and 2 will become 14. And then between these three number, we will select the lowest number or min. Okay, during the min turn. So 12, 6, and 14. So, of course, you will have to select 6. And this is the final answer. So, uh, that's all for the introduction towards uh, Minimax. We'll be seeing you... Again, uh, on the alpha beta pruning. Because in the final examination or final assessment, uh, the question will be focused more on alpha beta pruning. So, see you again on the second part.